Hello everybody, it's Steve. Welcome back to Anno 1800. In the last video, we settled our second island. I haven't figured out a name for it yet, and I'm not going to name it in this video. I'm going to take a recommendation from you, the audience, that I get in these videos this week, and hopefully figure out a nice name for it. The music in this game, by the way, is lovely. Let's see if there's any quests out there for me right there. We got Wormways Prison, all the way out over Nya. We have... Malahid Bay? Barrel of Marsh, she actually has some, uh, some flak emplacements and some cannon towers, so we're not going to be going to war with her for a bit, but Brighter Sands, we have a nice surplus of farmers and workers, and I probably should be working on Look getting busy, some weapons going. I don't have a lot of steel on the island, because I think I'm training a lot of it, but I do need to create some weapons. Where's my Guinevere? Guinevere's just kind of hanging out. Guinevere actually does need to move some materials over to it. So I'm going to transfer too many. I'm going to transfer some of that over there. Let's see. Honestly, I think that would be enough right now is just take a bunch of lumber over there and I'll start growing everything else. And Guinevere is going to come back over to Nya. Hopefully we can get some materials built over here and we can start building up our new settlement. But our quaint poor town of Brighter Sands looks like it needs some stuff. We're missing some goods here, so it's telling me I need to make more flour. Let's go ahead and get working on that. And oddly enough, for the farmers, it doesn't have it. You have to go over into this part of it. So we have a grain farm. Oh, wow. Look, it fits right there. And I can have 144... Start doing that. <laughs> That's 144 right there. Perfect. So now we have more grain being produced. Oops. Did not mean to put that right there. Now we have the grain being produced. It'll go right here and be converted into flour. And over here, that's a trade union. Where did I put my bakery? I think my bakery is way down here. Way down here. So we'll take in the flour into my warehouse, and we'll grab it right there, and we should be good to go. Alright, fun times. One of you is almost at our little settlement. Ah, that's right. You can buy shares of other folks' islands. So let me actually... You can see up here the shares. It would actually cost me 22000 to purchase a chunk of... Uh, her island. Let me actually see what she's got for here. It's going to be 111,000. She's, oh, as artisans. It's actually a pretty interesting one to take on. Um, this is just pirates, so I can't do anything with that. And down here, it's 46,000. A lot of workers on this one. Checking out Willie's, and this one's 45,000. So something that I had not explored I yet. I could simply go to press. I'm just going to cost you. Okay. Let's take a look at the newspaper. You look as radiant as ever. Yeah, this is actually all good. I don't have to do any edits for it. I like it. Publish it. So we're going to get plus 5 happiness, plus 10 happiness. And we're also going to get a minus 50% chance for rioting. It's important Let's actually head back to the end. And my shares right now, they're pretty... It must be no idea how much they're the good news with others. Happy to print the truth so that it improves further our relationship with her and see what we have in the storehouse do we need to improve our supply chain any eventually we will but let's go ahead and ah i need to build a warehouse over here let's see transfer all of it cool beans now here, we can actually upgrade that and get our marketplace built. We have 40 timber now available. Let's go ahead and slap down some houses. That's going to encourage some folks to arrive here. We're going to start making wood. And we're going to push the same thing we did over there. Now what I will do is probably take a road out this way into the woods 
like that. Warehouse is going to be needed. Put it on that corner. The sawmill. Right next to it. I'll take a look at my trade out here in just a moment. Now we're short again on people, which is fine. So we'll just bring in some more farmer residences. I'm down to six wood, but I can make more. So I'm not completely in trouble just yet. So our grain farm actually takes four. So I can work with that. Where to put it, though? I could actually set it off uh, way down here. Because there isn't much... Like, there's a lot of timber up here I can utilize. So I do kind of like the idea of... There's a limestone deposit there. Putting a lot of it kind of in this area. And the hop farm. Actually, the hop farm is probably what I need first. So let's see. I'll slap down a hop farm. And a hop farm is only 96. So let's see how much we can get. 20 that way. Come down this way with that. 88. Darn. Actually, that's perfect. So I can put another hop farm right there. And we need to some with this, so. Better safe than sorry. Okay. By your trading post. So this is a cannon tower. It takes cannons, which I don't think I have at the moment. Do I have any cannons at, right now? I'll circle back on that, but I'm probably going to need it sooner rather than later. I'll actually put a grain farm in there next to it. So actually we'll be producing both things simultaneously on there. Um, once I get my... How much do I need for that? One more. Once we get more wood produced, we'll be able to go ahead and work on that. So we'll come back to them in a little while. Back over in Brighter Sands. We've got plenty of uh, workers. Now let's see what the workers Thank are going to need to be happier. Not much in the way of common dignity. These folks are content. Got a happy farmer here. Could make them a worker. In fact, we are going to make them workers. Boop. There we go. And it looks like we need a little bit more to level them up. And that's probably what we're going to be doing with the gunboats here. So a gunboat... Oh, wow, we're actually pretty close to getting that already. We need three more guns. And then for the frigates, we need to get artisans. So we'll get to that, hopefully, in a little while. We also need to make sure we're sustaining 80% of the beer supply across the region. Back over to here. This one needs steel. So I could actually set up a trade route from our new settlement back to the city. I'm going to go ahead and uh, upgrade that grain farm. Do that. And, alright, we only have access to the stuff here on the warehouse. That works for me. So what I could end up doing now is doing a trade route. Yep. I'm going to do a trade route, I think, eventually between our new settlement and here. We actually will produce the beer over in this area. With the trade union that I built way down here, can I move him? Let's see if I could move him, I'd actually put him up here to actually work more in line with this. So let's see. Trade union. Big boost if I put him up here. Actually, right here is the best spot for it. There's no road for it there, so let me go ahead and slap that a little, uh, little country lane for him. Now he's connected to a road. Now this is the drill. It affects all clay pits, all saltpeter work, sand mine, limestone quarries, oil wells, box up, and helium collectors. This doesn't help either, but I could. It doesn't affect anything right now. But the joiner, like if I built down here and 
put another trade union in this area. This would be very helpful. But I will go ahead and I'll just I'll just apply her. Uh, equip an item and a trade union. Sorry, let me equip an item. You restore a grain of my trust in humanity. So that was mainly just to get rid of that quest. But unfortunately, the this isn't affecting them. If I can get something else that would impact these, I'll be in even better shape. Let's go back over to here to the workers. I could get a police station. Big sucker. It's right there, actually. And I will actually put a police station down. It, so we have our police station, we have our fire department right there. Training jolly police officers. We have plenty of farmers and workers for that, so I'm going to leave that there for the moment. Soap. How much am I doing with soap right now? I have 13 soap, which is telling me... My rendering works is producing. So this is every 30 seconds. This is every minute. So I actually need... One every minute. I think I need a second one of these guys, actually. Forty workers. Yep, I can work with this. How many pigs do I have available? Seventy-two. Excellent. So I start bringing in. So just take more pigs over here, render them into tallow, and then we can start producing more soap. The more and the soap again is a really, really pot or not popular but beneficial uh, thing I can have. And back over to my other settlement here. These folks appear to be happy, and I'm okay with that. We are what is it, missing material? Missing grain field. It's 141 and 144. I think we're okay if we're just missing a couple here. I don't think the world's gonna completely go ass over tea kettle if I don't do that. Alright. What I wanna do eventually is start trading here. It's not my job to know their crimes. So I can only to find a fitting Yada 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 yada. Pick up the coal and sell them the soap. So if I can actually produce more soap, that's actually going to be more beneficial to me. The cool thing, though, is that soap is actually a need for workers. So if I can get this up and running really, really good, I'll be in good... Stores are inundated. Oh, that's a problem. Um, I wasn't expecting to hear that one. 30 seconds, 15 seconds. Okay, yeah, you know what? I will just pause Take you guys. Let's like you move... said we could... Yeah, let's go ahead and move you guys elsewhere. Can I use the iron anywhere else? It doesn't appear that way yet. But the brewery will be needed here. And actually, that's going to take up a lot of my folks. Ooh, speaking of... Let's build our first gunboat. It's going to take three minutes to build, but we'll sell those off, and then hopefully we'll figure out how to get to artisans, and the artisans will get us our... I'm going to get there. <laughs> I forgot what I was going to say. It's going to get us towards artisans and frigates. Keeping our balance looking good. Got our police station. Riot chance is non-existent. So pretty much just trying to keep the peace right now. Got the music. Oh, wow. Can I fit a church in somewhere? Oh, that's going to be a thing. That's going to be a nice thing. Can I put it next to the schnapps? Actually, I'll put it down here. Can I make a new block? It's got a pretty good reach. I'm saying you have even better reach over here. I'm short on bricks for it, but I am going to plan that out. So once I do get the bricks... I'll be able to expand it. There's another clay deposit up here I want to utilize, also over here. And I do think it may be time to further expand my reach with this. Of gift giving. Um, no, that is quite nice. I do need to make sure that I'm making, uh, get this number into the positive sooner rather than later. So I've got a lot of workers. My maintenance is quite high right now. Over here. Oh. Let's go ahead and get some fishing going down here. That'll actually be helpful for the marketplace. Wasn't even considering that. Uh, schnapps and work clothes are basic needs on this island. I should probably address that also. Okay, so potato farmings. 
Lambent right for farming, that. There we go. That's good. And then missing pati Oh, whoops. Ah. Something to be learned here. This island can't grow potatoes. It can grow fur. It has furs and grape fertility. I don't have access to grapes yet. Two limestone deposits, two coal, two iron. So I can't actually grow potatoes here. So it means I need to bring schnapps in there here. Enough of us. Ah, yes, because I now have my fishery. You need a warehouse, you do. All right, let's get a warehouse up and running over here. Yeah. That's a marketplace. Eventually, I'll get this right. And we'll go ahead and build a couple more farmer residences down here. Still in range, find you, of the marketplace. So we're good on that front. We'll get some more folks over here, and that'll keep things going. We're back over in Brighter Sands now. Seeing what we have. Constructed. Nice. And we'll go ahead and build our church. By the service to your residence. Your father, but his spirit... Falcon ready. Cool. I come over here. And we'll sell it to Archibald Blake. And it should be able to bring us in a quick infusion of cash. Wow, warships is minus 25. Look at that, by the way. Too many transporters loading delayed. Can we... Okay, once we get the bricks, we can actually upgrade this warehouse. Because there's a lot of folks around here. This one's a very, very busy warehouse. These loading ramps will make things much easier for me. I could also put a second warehouse down here to maybe address these folks. Not a horrible idea, mind you. And if I did want to expand out, I probably would take this road across the river and access these two clay, clay pits. Which, uh, don't get me wrong, I'm really considering it right now. Right here, we need 20 bricks. We're going to be using... We're going to be shy on brick for a bit. But down here... She's small, but she's keen. Let's go ahead and sell them. What a jolly, jolly 62.50? I'll take them. That's one of our two. Now... What do we have over here? Do we have the hops? We have five hops. We have no grain. Because it's all being processed into flour. So let's pause one of these guys. Who's almost done? Give me this one. Once this one finishes up, we're actually going to pause production on the flour mill. Because we're going to need it to produce the beer. And actually, we need... Actually, we're missing a component on this, too. We need the malt house. So... We won't be able to do that just yet. We need to do the malt house. And then a brewery to produce it. How big is a malt house? Ooh. Oh, he's actually a pretty good size. I want to put him near a warehouse for obvious reasons. The brewery's probably going to make a stink. So I'm thinking a malt house could fit in here. It actually went down right away. And then a brewery would fit next to it also. Okay. But the brewery looks like there's a range on it and how it uh, can impact people. I'm going to set him there and just have that as a blueprint for the moment. Let's figure out what we need to do to get that going. Down here now. We are two guns shy. Uh, produce that. So let's see. Just curious on this one. Loading speed, two item slots, cargo slots. Okay. Get back over to our new colony. Nice day for it. Oh, I don't think I have put a road here. There we go. There's a warehouse right here now. Which was a bit odd. Hmm. All right folks here. They're missing fish, and I don't think we have a cotton. There's a sheep. Yeah, sheep we could do here. That That's feasible, isn't it?
Oh, three. El Derpo. This one needs grain. Doesn't help me here. We'll put that there. We're now super short on uh, farmers here, but we can address that. Take a road out this way. How good are you doing over here? Available area, 100%. Awesome, awesome. That will address the farmer workforce shortage I have here. You reached a new milestone. Hey, we now have a fair village. Again, give me a name for this guy. Let's let's make it. Let's make him useful. All right, cool. So now we're short on produ production over here, but we're now supplying some of the things that we need in this fair village. Back to brighter sands. We have plenty of stuff going on over here. We are. Oh yeah, we can actually build that. We've run out of gubbins. <laughs> I haven't heard the name gubbins in a while. But actually, we need this upgraded. So, how's our grain doing here? We have no grain stored on the island. That's a problem. Better check on my little ones. Yeah, we're gonna take one of these offline. Meant to do that earlier. Hopefully. We can start producing, moving this grain and getting to where it needs to be. The silo improvement. Let's see. Clay pit. Brick factory. Awesome. I'm going to pause this too. I need to make sure more grain is becoming available. And if that means I have to put another grain farm up here next to the pigs, uh, you know what? That's actually a good idea. Let's do that. We're doing dedicated grain production here. We'll produce the grain. Don't bring it right across the street to the malt house, where it's going to get turned into malt. And then from there, once I have malt production, big key there, I can take the brewery and take the hops. I don't have the fertility here, which is fine, because I don't have the grain fertility. Yet. Well, I do have the grain fertility here, but I don't have the materials here. If I can just have this producing all the hops I need, which, by the way, I do need to copy this hops farm in a second. If I'm producing enough hops to send it back over to Brighter Sands, that should, keyword, alleviate some of the problems. So, let's make another hop farm. I'll build this one back here, connect it with a road. Then build our farm out. Let's go about here. Oh yeah, there we go. That's a nice looking hop farm. Big hop farm back there. Now, we can send it, we can kind of get it over to this warehouse. This warehouse can put it on the ship. And then, we immediately, oh, cool. And then when my little trading ship comes we back. However we may. Am I taking timber over to these guys? Are they Can they store any more timber? Yeah, they can. It's just a matter of making sure I'm getting the things moving to where they... From where they need to be to where they need to definitely be. Cool. We're now producing... Malt. Slowly, though. Alright, cool. We're getting those things done. And now to address the clay problem. That's been... An issue for a bit, I will acknowledge this. So building on these two clay deposits will help my pro help alleviate some problems I have. I'm actually gonna connect both roads, mind you. I wanna do like this. So there's a straight shot. If anybody needs to get back to the harbor, they can do it quickly. I also want to check this. I think a couple more fire stations are needed up here. And definitely back here. Wait, how many people does this need? No, okay. I'm gonna put a fire station there. And a fire station here. Making sure that I've got the responses, the, the, that ability to respond if needed, especially when the fire chance is 
Right now it's low. Let's keep it almost non-existent. Was my other gumboat finished, or did I not build my other gumboat yet? Check my navy. Every ship. Let's see here. You're just hanging out. That's okay. Actually, I want you to kind of head down this way, please. There's a big gap in the map down here on the left. I haven't really done much with it yet. Here, let's build that gunboat. We're going to take a huge hit on available workers for a little while. Let's see how we're doing here. Yeah, we are missing the worker workforce. Can't be helped. Got to build that gunboat. Kind of curious. How do we upgrade Straight you guys further? Out of the gutter, you did. Okay. Happiness. Working conditions are zero. The beer is a luxury need. That will push him over the top. And that'll get it to the artisans, which will get us the frigate. So let's just see what the frigate's going to need. I can't even look up at how much it's going to cost me. Dang. Okay. Thinking we need to build another subdivision down this way. We've got our marketplace, which is helping a lot of folks. And I think another one right down here is going to be good. But yeah, the beer is an issue. Rum, clay pipe, soccer balls. Oh, that's kind of cool. Hot sauce, jam, and penny farthings. Okay, I'm... I love the little things here. Oh, we found a new island. It's an unsettled island. It has red peppers, grapes, grain, and potato. Whoa. Copper deposits, limestone, iron... It's a beautiful island. I just don't think I need it. I do need to defend what I have, mind you. I'm not... Uh, I'm not glossing over that. I do think at some point there will be combat where I'm going to have to defend brighter sands. I'm just not expecting it to happen anytime soon. Aye. Okay, you're bringing over hops. Is that all the hops they're producing right now? It's just four? Two... I'm thinking I just need to just go absolutely nuts with hops production over here. Because we have... Oh, wow. It's... Wait, hang on. It's only... It's producing every minute and a half? Okay. I did not take time to, you know, take that into account and how long this is going to take. I need a shitload more farms. Okay. Beer. Hops. Nyah. Here. Fields. Can you like this? There we go. Perfect. Now we're producing, and I'm putting another one right next to it, and we're going to produce a shitload more. There we go. Now we're producing more hops. This has been my problem the entire episode. Also, big problem is that I'm losing money. Like, a shitload of money. Ship constructed. Ready. Get down here and get yourself sold quick. Gotta figure out how to start making some cash here, and I think it's bringing in more people. Uh, the brewery is ready, so we can do that and start producing this stuff. Alright. I think we need to start... Uh, Stopping some stopping work on some things. Okay. Yeah. I think I need to stop working on like a lot of stuff at the moment. <laughs> there we go. That stemmed the bleeding for a little bit. What? Oh, around there it probably is very high. Hey, googly moogly. Falcon ready. I present my humble duty. There we go. Saves me a little bit of time, but I need to start making some cash. Bring more people in. That may help alleviate the problem. Okay, plus 34 of the houses here, plus 9. Hmm. Hmm. 
Okay. So yeah, it's just essentially just bringing more people in. And unfortunately, I've had to shut these buildings off because I don't have the cash for There we go. Now we're in the now we're in the green or the gold or whatever you want to call it. I got me family. So this is taking 20 to produce grain. My malt house, there we go. There we go. Working on this one. And now that we're producing beer, we can hopefully increase these workers' happinesses to a point where I can upgrade them and get artisans and hopefully get even more money coming my way. Okay. Ooh. Peddlers say there's nowhere to take. Wait, what? Oh wow, yeah, the warehouse is not in range for this. So let's go ahead and put down a small warehouse. Oh wait. Oh, it just doesn't it barely doesn't not fit. Many changes, I hope. Okay, hang on a second. Let's get that warehouse down. Nope, that's a residence. Oh, it's just gonna ruin the whole motif here. Just a skosh too small. Wait, hang on a second. There we go. Boom, right there. And now they can deliver the hops over this way. But this one, unfortunately, is now 90 of 96. I might be able to put those last six up there at the top. There we go. All right, now I'll go back to my other island and deal with the newspaper. I'll get that out the door. And yeah, I'll probably put a cut in here too. Huh. All right, not bad. So built a fleet, sold the fleet, and promised land. Yeah, I'm good with that. I'm not going to say I didn't think it possible. <laughs> and as pleased you can now provide beer to your people. So we have that done. And we, get a, and we get an auto save. That's nice. So we're missing residents. But we're getting to the point, I think. Yeah, dangerous for me, I know. Okay, so Brighter Sands is doing plus 700. What are you doing over here? You're doing minus 200 because you're not producing a lot. We also have, like, super unhappiness. Because I don't have schnappies. So I can't do potatoes here. Let me go to my trade route and see if I can start bringing schnapps over here for the people. We'll load schnappies. We'll do that. Okay, cool. That kind of works now. So I'll probably need to produce more. We put our love into this this and you're okay so you're producing that we probably need to do another one-to-one -one on potato farms to schnapps production see what else i can do right now because that honestly is the big thing to uh, help this increase the happiness over here is yeah, I can upgrade these guys to workers, but what do I need to work with over here? This coal deposit is an iron deposit, which means I can bring iron back to the other island, but this is predominantly farming. There isn't too terribly much that can be done here, though. Lots of questions being raised here. It also is telling me that I'm pretty much at a point I can't move much further, I can't advance much further in the game, because, let's see... Trying to see how we can increase their happiness a little bit more. So, okay. Island-wide unlock precondition is getting 750 workers on the island. I don't want to do that. Well, I could actually do that. Let's see. Do I have any farmhouses I can upgrade? Yeah, see? Missing a certain fertility, that's what I was talking about earlier. Alright, I don't see any way I can do this just yet. That's good. Which means I probably could do another one of these guys. Let's actually do that. Let's actually produce more clothing. 
So yeah, being able to produce more clothes, that's going to help meet some needs. I saw this person doesn't have that need met just yet, but if we can get the worker number a little bit higher, and I'm pretty sure got all this stuff on hold again, I'm keeping this on pause until I can get my bank account a little bit healthier. And I'm not sure I can do missing goods. Yeah. So we essentially need more of that. And I'm getting more... We can't shut the storeroom door! Fine, then just stop production. There you go, kids. Solves that problem. <laughs> and it's also now... Inspection. I'm not dealing with... Yeah, 125. I could probably sell those. But now I'm having a ton of sales available. I could use the... I could just build a ship and sell it. Build ships and sell them. That could be the route I go for a while. I also have plenty of workers to do it, so you know what? I'm actually just going to do that. I'm going to build two uh, schooners, and I'm just going to sell them to people. Um, to see if I can make some money off of it. I mean, Is it duty that brings you here, or pleasure? Offers, schnapps, and pigs. Wow. This is actually really nice over here. Sign or trader I shoot through diplomacy. So I wouldn't mind actually doing some more trades, and I think that's going to be what I do next week. I've been going for 40 minutes. I, I'm pretty sure this video is going to be close to it because I've been talking most of the time. Next week, going to get the clay deposits up and running. I'm going to get just keep building up this island, get the artisans unlock done because we we're, we're on the cusp of getting it. And I do think what the next step is going to be is upgrading my farmers just a little bit further because I just need to give them that last little bit on a lot of these houses get them to a point where I can upgrade and get enough workers <laughs> and we'll be able to push into the next phase of the game but for now like what oh this one's an upgrade too actually no this one needs an upgrade first we'll see that right now for now like, comment, share, and subscribe if you enjoyed this video and all the videos that come out on this channel. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all in the next video.